Hey everyone, it's Ben at Fright Rags, and uh, just wanted to give you a quick look at the Terminator mask we're releasing next Wednesday, October 22nd, on FrightRags.com. We've been getting a few questions about um, what the mask looks like in person, and I just wanted to shoot this quick video to give you a look at it. So, as you can see, this is the front. Now, the idea behind this was to create a Ben Cooper sort of Collegeville style mask. If you remember the Ben Cooper costumes from the 70s and the 80s and uh, Collegeville costumes, you can see a couple back there. They used to come in these cool cardboard boxes and they had these cheap plastic masks and these really thin vinyl costumes um, that came with them. I remember I was actually that Hulk for, for Halloween when I was four. And I just loved them. I loved when they came into the toy stores and the Halloween stores when I was a kid. I would just go through all the boxes and try to find a cool character to be for Halloween. So we wanted to go back to that uh, with some of the stuff that we're doing. So for instance, we did Tarman last year, as you can see. And when we got the license to do Terminator, I thought it would be a really cool idea to do that with Terminator as well. So we were able to work with a factory in China to make these for us. And I think they just came out wonderful. We, uh, as you can see, they are sculpted pretty amazingly. And um, it was actually sculpted based on a drawing by Nate Thomas Milliner. And as you can tell, it looks pretty darn close to the endoskeleton used in the Terminator. And it's a pretty big mask, too. It's actually bigger than a lot of the uh, Ben Cooper style masks. We wanted to capture as much detail as possible, so we had to make it pretty deep so it would fit around the face and sort of, sort of uh, encompass the face a bit more. And there it looks in the front, and then in the back side, it's still made of the plastic. It's vacuum-form plastic. It's still it's rigid. It's not gonna completely. It's not gonna crack on you. It's it's pliable, but it's still that vacuum-form plastic. The rubber band, that's that's definitely an upgrade from those old Ben Cooper style costumes. That's not gonna snap on you three houses in. Uh, the white part you see in the back there is actually a covering for the electronics that hold the lights in place. And the mechanism that turns it on is right here. It's glued into the side here. Let me just get that switch on. Now you can see the lights. You can see the lights from behind. It does not impede your vision. Uh, when you put it on, you can see the eye holes there. And it really doesn't affect it at all. But when you turn it around, it looks pretty sick. And the uh, eye holes are kind of obscured a little bit. So it just looks really cool. And of course, you can wear this around if you wanted to. I prefer to just hang it up on the walls, a nice little display piece. Uh, but you can do whatever you want with it. The lights actually last pretty long. We went to a convention recently, and we left the lights on for the whole show. And I think we counted 24, 26 hours these things lasted. I think you could probably change the battery in the mechanism. This one's a prototype, so it doesn't have the on-off. Uh, label or the, the legal item yet, but the ones that you guys will get will have that. Uh, you could probably sort of unglue this. This is I unglued this to kind of get a better look at it and maybe change the battery in there. I haven't tried that yet, but it will last quite a long time and it looks cool without the lights on too. So this is the look at the Terminator mask. Again, this is going to be 60 bucks with an exclusive t-shirt. There's only a thousand of these made and it's being released next Wednesday at 10 a.m. That's Wednesday, October 22nd at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. So check your clocks, please. We get a lot of people wondering where it's going to be, and you got to make sure it's 10 o'clock Eastern Time in the morning. And uh, again, there's only a thousand of these made. It comes in an exclusive shirt. You can check the link out below to get more details. And uh, make sure to check out FrightRags.com. That's Fright-Rags.com. Thanks.